Hey everybody, this is Eric Clark's Travel Videos. I'm here um, at, uh, this used to be the National Library before the war. After the war, it turned into City Hall. And so now it's City Hall and it's, you can see from behind me, it's pretty amazing. And uh, um, I guess I'll take you through it and show you around. Here's what the ticket looks like. It costs 10 marks to get in here. So about maybe five, 50, six bucks. Um, but uh, I'll walk you through and see what I can show you and uh, I'll go from there and I'll start trying to look at the pictures and <laughs> talk to you guys, okay? Bye everybody. Hey everybody. Um, this is the National Library, like I said, and or was the National Library before the war and now it is the uh, um, City Hall and it's really amazing and you know the camera doesn't do that justice. It certainly does justice on some of these arches and some of the paintings and the Muslim architecture. Amazing. And the arches are pretty slick too. And even the floors are amazing. And it's a big, big open space. And they have different art around that area too. Well, I guess I'll go walk around and see what else I can find, everybody. Wow, even the stairs are amazing, too. Okay, everybody. I'll keep you posted on where I end up. <laughs> I'm not big on reading these things, but I figure I'd stop and uh, take a second and read this one to you. Breathtaking stained glass ceiling has a diameter of 11.5 meters, 38 feet, it's almost 40 feet, and contains 829 pieces of hand-painted colored glass. To hear the full story, you can scan that uh, barcode and then go listen. But again, this is what I already showed you. This is the atrium. Monumental staircase. The lower part of the wall, the surface which follows the staircase, ends in the first floor, is decorated with hand painted imitation tiles. So, this is the staircase. And I guess these are all hand painted. Wow. Amazing. Okay, I'll go upstairs. Bye. All right, this is upstairs. I was just down there. Now I'm a little closer to the stained glass. But the work on the columns is amazing. And the painting is amazing. Yeah, it's all... Very neat. Big marble columns. Huh. All right. I'll get on to the next section. So a couple of things I wanted to point out. Can you hear that? I'll let you listen for a second. It's the Game of Thrones theme. <laughs> kind of interesting. Cool, everybody. Thank you. Here is the 
what is this? Ceremonial hall. Walls and rooms gilded in almost every surface and the entire room is wonderfully decorated and ornamented by colorful hands. It doesn't let me go any further than this. I don't know that they'd like me jumping it, so I guess I'll I'll move on to be a good boy. I went by four, I think, or three, and then it went to seven. So, and I guess this is the old staircase that used to be here before the war. It didn't get destroyed. But what's interesting about this room is I think it's like the people that have been here before, and it tells about them. This one's kind of crooked. Kind of straighten him back up. to say it but um, <laughs> I don't think I know any of them. But I did find a 10. So I'm now on the 7 to 10 and this is the memorial room. Franz and Sophie. I guess that's Franz and Sophie. furniture. Alright, well I'm going to see if I can find some more numbers. So, <laughs> this is number 8. Ceiling and surface of the entire building is carefully covered. Looks like they got something going on in here. I think I'm going to get thrown out of here in about two seconds. Maybe this is Parliament or something? Look at all the computers and look at all the you get to buzz in and talk and huh. nobody said anything yet, so I guess I'm gonna keep videotaping until uh, until it's a no go. Huh. Amazing. Alright, I'm gonna get out of here. But the statehood day. Um, cool and band 1189 and a diplomat and things you can read that. But. Well, I guess it's a history, newer from older. 1189. Van Coolen's charter written in the oldest known document in the Bosnia Chancellery, Brother Rose, blah, 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 10th century. doors. Well, I guess I'm going to go this way. See if people are going to hear that they're coming around. Thanks for coming, everybody. I guess that's it. I can't find any more numbers, and I've asked two people, and uh, <laughs> uh, they don't they don't quite understand numbers and one, two, three, and all those things. But uh, anyway, that's it. Thanks for sharing the old uh, library with me. Bye, everybody.